The Glasgow Necropolis is an iconic cemetery on the eastern side of the centre of Glasgow. It attracts visitors from all over the world, all year round. The Necropolis has been described as a unique representation of Victorian Glasgow. It is a memorial to the merchant patriarchs of the city and contains the remains of almost every eminent Glaswegian of its day. The necropolis has a very meticulous and complex design. This is no ordinary graveyard. Everything you see, whether it be an unassuming plant or slate covering the path, is meant. The reason it is designed this way is so the visitor discovers something new each time they visit. The necropolis looks over Glasgow Cathedral. Glasgow Cathedral has been sacred for more than 1,500 years. Here the cross was planted and the ground blessed for Christian burial by St Ninian. The first stone built cathedral was dedicated in 1136 in the presence of King David. The height of the nave is 105 feet. Some of the timber may date from the 14th century. The cathedral has never been unroofed and has been used as a church for more than 800 years. The cathedral is allegedly located where the patron saint of Glasgow, St Mungo, built his church. This is his tomb right here. Every year a commemorative service is held in honour of his memory. The necropolis in the Glasgow Cathedral are two iconic landmarks which make Glasgow the city of culture that it is today.